Bonnie, happy Sunday! I am back! Oh my gosh, you guys, it's like 79 degrees out today. A little windy, a little cooler by the lake, but I was actually able to go outside a little bit, which was really nice. Um, definitely helped my voice. I was trying to rest it all day. This is one of those like colds that just keeps going. I don't feel bad. I just keep coughing. Um, I'm fine, but it's just one of those things it keeps going. So all good. I'm ready to talk a little bit about summer. I got a couple fun summer things for you. So we're going to talk about Firecracker Pop. I just saw in Tess's blog that Firecracker Pop is definitely coming back this summer. You never know. Um, so I'm excited that's coming back. I'm going to put up a screenshot right here. Jenny Ann sent me this screenshot. This is a cowboy hat, a pink cowboy hat pocket bag with white fringe. This is going to be popular. I am so excited about this. I got to get my hands on one of those. So thank you, Jenny, for sending me that. Um, Lush, I just ordered the Shrek collection. I'm going to talk about that in another video. I'm like, are you kidding me? Shrek? Um, I talked about yesterday. Uh, Slackening Company has a grape soda candle. I feel summer coming. Everything is turning up summer. I'm going to put another screenshot up here. Lenny and I have been very busy working on summer products for Bonleo. We have this beautiful iris tote bag. I've been painting. Um, Lenny's been painting. We have pride stuff. We have beach stuff. So check out Bonleo for um, some cool beach stuff. I'm going to start working on Halloween soon. I'm going to do it, you guys. I know, the H word. <laughs> no one wants to hear the H word, but then we're all kind of like, oh, it's funny. Um, Tess's blog, uh, she did mention a couple of Halloween stuff that's like starting to roll in. I'm not, to, I'm not gonna talk about it yet. It was like pocket bags and stuff, but we're starting to get the names for stuff. I'm like, oh my gosh. So that was exciting. Um, so Firecracker Pop, yay. I'm gonna put another screenshot up right here. The original Firecracker Pop um, was actually this one with the stripe. And then last, no, not last year, the year before, we got the Popsicle, the Bomb Pop. I can't even find my Bomb Pop. I don't know what happened to it. I might have given it to my sister-in-law. It is adorable. Look at that. Super cute. Love that design. And then last year, we had this one. So I don't know what we're going to get this year. So we're on our fourth version of Firecracker Pop. It's a great summer scent. It is red cherry, fresh citrus, and juicy berry. And um, it smells amazing. I liked the blue top. I got to say, that was like a nice upgrade. You know me and my uh, Mr. Tops. I, I like the metallic ones. They're so cute. So... This one smells like the juiciest, most um, delicious cherry with a hint of citrus in there. It's funny because the citrus um, gives it a little bit of a different scent. It's like, it's that maraschino cherry full on. It's like a juicy cherry with a squeeze of lemon and then possibly like a raspberry, blueberry, strawberry mix popped in there. But you get kind of like a medley of different um, juicy fruits, but it's very strong. It's very, um, it's almost a little bit sour. I, it's, I think if Jelly Rancher had a firecracker pop flavor, it would be this. It's not quite full on cherry because of the citrus and the other berries in there, but it definitely has a very like juicy quality, um, which a lot of people love. So Firecracker Pop is a really strong one too. Like this is going to last you. Uh, let me smell the original here. I think it's pretty stable. Yeah, it smells pretty much the same. It's funny. I get a hint more cherry in the first one, but I feel like uh, last year's was a lot stronger. It's interesting. There's a little bit more of a cherry note in this one. I didn't notice that before. Very interesting, Bath & Body Works. I think they might have changed the formula a little bit. This one kind of fades off a lot quicker, though. I feel like last year's was pretty strong. We also um, 
usually have this in a candle. Uh, so, oh my gosh, I cannot believe all the 4th of July stuff that is rolling out. It's funny. It's like Easter ended. Mother's Day is kind of tucked in there, but then it's like all red, white, and blue. So it's coming. Anyway, let me know what you guys think, and I will see you later. Bye-bye.